great idea. What you want to say is, is an election promise fulfilled. Secondly, Edra cannot go in any country unless you have a strong air transportation. If a businessman is coming from China and wants to come to Nigeria, the very moment the PA tells the Chinese investor, okay, look, you have to go through Europe before you get to Nigeria, he's discouraged. So you've lost an investor. The next thing the minister should do is to ensure that the Fly Nigerian Act is sent to the National Assembly. What does the Fly Nigerian Act say? That yes, a certain percentage of the traffic goes to the national carrier. They have to protect the investment on the, on the national carrier. Along with the national carrier, will come the innovation leasing company, an MRO, as well as training institute. So therefore, we, when this takes off on December 24th, as it's been planned, I assure you it's going to be one of the best things that has ever happened to this country. Once you know the onions, they are operating normal like an airline. The only thing is that they should not take advantage of the government and people's uh, funds. Sir. It should be private driven. That's our advice. Okay, sir. Total. There should be no interference from government like what happened to Nigeria. Airways. We hope that with that uh, airline, uh, we're going to have more jobs created. And I believe establishment of a national carrier, there will be a relative low you know, airfare. Other airlines that are there, they will buckle up. More than 90% of uh, aviation revenue goes to uh, the foreign carriers. And this is not good for our economy. It's not good for our people. We need to generate a lot of, a lot of employment. We need to have a strong uh, career. And then uh, I believe that the government is uh, uh, thinking along the line of um, uh, establishing a big career that, uh, that can at least compete with uh, um, uh, other carriers like Emirates, BAA and all of You can see what other African carriers are doing. They are the ones that we threaten the Nigerian carrier, but a national carrier will strengthen we create a new platform for Nigerian domestic carriers. My take is that anything that provides options, choices, and fair pricing for consumers is welcome. To the extent that that is an opportunity for us to expand the scope, provide better services, challenge others to provide better services, and more timely departures and arrivals, give consumers more choices and flexibility, and also uh, competitive pricing, I think it's a phenomenal idea. So I feel that any organization that will be threatened by a market entry clearly needs to take another look at how it does its customer service. Because at the end of the day, customers would only show their loyalty to a brand that truly delivers what is in their best interest.